Hey guys, what's up? Demad Rocket Scientist 007 here, and welcome to another War Thunder plane review. Today we're going to be reviewing the F2A3 Buffalo. Uh, it is designed by Brewster. It was introduced. The first design was introduced in 1935 to create a carrier-based monoplane to replace the outdated biplanes. It's uh, production started in the summer of 1938. Only 55 F2A3s were built. Uh, the F2A2 was more widely produced and given to or sold to many countries. But uh, the F2A3 was uh, only made 55 of these models and 11 were sold to Finland for their duties. Uh, it is a naval fighter in game and it's got an arrestor hook and everything to land on aircraft carriers. Its engine is a 950 horsepower single row right cyclone radial engine. Its armament is four 12.7 millimeter or 50 caliber Browning machine guns with 325 rounds each for a total of 1300 rounds. Uh, its maximum speed is 518 kilometers per hour. Crew capacity of one. And now I'm going to take it out onto a test flight. And be right back. Okay, so guys, I'm back. And uh, I'm on a carrier, as you can see, because this is a naval fighter. So the cockpit is very good side view slightly obstructed rear view because of a tubular frame but we have the side rear here which allows us to see uh, to our rear so our blocked rear view is not too bad and as you can see we cannot see a lot while taking off and uh, taxiing but um, that's to be expected of a tail dragger it is a closed canopy as you can see here and it has two 100 pound bombs as you can see here under the wings it has good maneuverability but it has poor forward visibility during taxiing and takeoff and its nickname is the buffalo so, as you can see here, it goes quite fast. I'm going uh, 360 kilometers per hour. And on that note, I'm going to end the video here, guys. Thanks for watching, and hope to see you in the next video. Take care. Bye.